Steam Overlay feature lets you use several Steam features while you are playing. To open the overlay while playing a game, just press the Shift plus Tab keys on your keyboard. If your Steam Overlay is not working when you open it with Shift plus Tab, or if nothing happens when you do. This video will show you the ways to fix the problem. It is highly advised that you restart your computer before attempting any of the troubleshooting actions that are detailed in this video. This procedure restarts the operating system and deletes any corrupt temporary data that may be contributing to the issue that you are experiencing. One of the reasons this problem will happen is that Steam doesn't have access to administrative tools. Give this program administrative access and then see if the problem still happens. Open the Steam directory. The default location of it is C, Program Files, Steam. Locate a file named steam.exe then right click on it and select Properties. Select the Compatibility tab from the top of the screen at the bottom of the window. You will see a checkbox stating run this program as an administrator. Make sure it is checked. Save changes and exit. Make sure that this feature is turned on before you can use Steam Overlay. Open your Steam client. Click on the option named Steam present in the upper left side of the window. From the drop down box select settings to open the settings interface. Click on the in game tab present on the left side of the screen. Here you will see a checkbox stating enable the Steam Overlay while in game. Make sure it is checked. You can also check if you are pressing the correct overlay shortcut keys. You can also change them if you want. Click on the library tab present in the top of the window. The games that are installed in your computer will be listed here. Right click on the game in which the overlay isn't working and select properties. You will see another checkbox stating enable the Steam overlay while in game. Make sure it is checked. Restart Steam. There are some third party programs that can make Steam Overlay not work as it should. Fraps and Synapse are two apps that have been known to cause trouble. Close these apps using the task manager and then see if the problem is still there. If the Steam Overlay seems to be having an issue only when playing a certain game, you can try the Steam Repair tool. Here's what you need to do. Open your Steam client and click Library present on the top. Select the game in which Steam Overlay fails to open. Right click on the game which is giving you the error and select Properties. Once in the Properties, browse to the Local Files tab and click on the option which says Verify Integrity of Game Files. Steam will then start verifying all the files present if there is any file missing. Corrupt it. It will download that file again and replace it accordingly. Go to your settings by pressing the settings option after clicking Steam present in the bottom left corner of the screen. Once in the settings, open the downloads tab present at the left side of the interface. You will see a box in which it is written Steam library folders. Click it. All your Steam content information will be listed. Right click on it and select repair library files. Restart Steam. Virus software can sometimes get in the way of how Steam works. It could be the cause of this overlay problem. To fix this, try to disable any antivirus or security software you may be running and see if that will work. It's possible that this problem is caused by the firewall on your computer. To find out, you'll have to turn it off. Here's how. Type firewall in the search dialog. Select the option which says Windows Defender Firewall. Look for an option which says Turn Windows Firewall on or off. It will be present at the left side of the screen. There are two checkboxes, one for private networks and the other for public networks. You can easily disable firewall for both of them by clicking the option Turn off Windows Firewall. After making the changes, click OK to save your settings and exit. Click the Start button and then the gear icon to open the Settings app. Go to Update and Security. Click on Check for Updates. If there are updates then it will download them and ask before installing. Restart your computer after the updates have been installed. If the problem isn't fixed by the steps earlier, you will need to update the Steam files. Go to your Steam directory. The default location for your directory is this. Locate the following files and folders. User data, Steam.exe, Steam apps, delete all other files. Folders. Take note that you should only delete the game inside the Steam Apps folder that is giving you problems. Restart Steam. It will redownload the missing file.
that's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.